In this clip, we show a human leader being followed by two robots. The human leader is wearing an infrared harness strapped on his back. The robots track the infrared sources on the harness using the IR camera in the Wiimotes on them. Each robot chooses a safe zone for itself and tries to maintain a certain distance and angle from the leader. The goal is to transport the robots collectively, so the leader is cooperative to the extent that he does not move too fast for the robots or take sudden sharp turns. The leader may also pause at times if a robot needs to catch up. In this clip, the IR harness is mounted on a wheeled chair for ease of experiment. The chair is still moved around by a human and acts as a proxy leader. While turning, some robots lose the leader and start scanning. They continue following when they locate the leader. Note that the leader pauses for a while when one of the robots lags behind. All the robots successfully maneuver the right angle turn and achieve spatial coherence again in the end. The following experiments use a robot as the leader to systematically study the robot group behavior. A robot leader allows repeatability of the experiments and control of the leader speed and the trajectory. All robots have differently colored markers on them so they can be easily tracked using a camera. A blob detection algorithm is used to track the robot trajectories. The green robot acts as a proxy leader and moves at a constant speed. In this clip, the leader's IR harness is blocked temporarily to see how the group recovers from a lost leader scenario. The robots start scanning when they lose the leader, but recover easily when the leader is visible again. When the leader makes a U-turn, the IR harness goes out of view and the robots keep scanning until they locate it again. Note the backing up behavior of the orange robot when the leader collides with it while passing through the group. More details about our work can be found in the paper. This video was a production of the Robotic Embedded Systems Lab at USC.